Hi everyone, it's Andrea here and it's Friday the 16th of December and it being Friday that means time for Friday Reads. So I've had quite a stressful week and as you know I'm mostly reading non-fiction at the moment for some reason, I don't know why. Um, mainly because I'm trying to finish off some of the books I started earlier in the year and because my friend lent me a book. But because I've had such a stressful week I'm on a nice relaxing weekend so I'm going to lay off the non-fiction for uh, Friday, Saturday and Sunday and literally this is just for the weekend. I'm going to read some non-fiction and one's very light, well I call it light, for me it's light and um, one's, I don't know. So um, yeah, so tomorrow on Saturday I will be having a lie-in because I'm not working this weekend, mainly because I've been, but I've been ill this weekend and as I said I've been a bit super stressful, I had problems with my car, my blood pressure's up, work is hectic, so nice relaxing weekend get up, make a cup of tea and take some toast and just sit in bed and read Harry Potter and the Goblet of Fire. That is my plan for Saturday morning. Saturday afternoon I'll be having my hair cut, um, trimmed and the colour put through um, so I can just relax. I usually take a book to read there so it may well be I may just take the dust jacket off Harry Potter and take Harry Potter or alternatively the other book I want to read this weekend is Still Missing by Beth Guchin which is my the only Persephone book I currently own but it won't be the last because they are stunning. Um, this book is about a boy named Alex who disappears and his mother is looking for him and she wonders what would have done if she had done something differently so the phone's ringing if she had answered it would the clock would, would things have worked out differently um so i want to read this one this one's been hanging around since august i think i bought it because it was i i just like the sound of the story um but i haven't fancied reading it until now and now i just can't wait to get started so this weekend it will be harry potter and harry potter and still missing um i could one of them will be going to the hairdressers with me if I read, finish both of these on the weekend, it is possible I have done that before. I might pick something else or I might just go back to, to my non-fiction. So it's been a hell of a week. I'm looking forward to the weekend and not having to go to work. My car is sorted. Yeah, I had a problem with my exhaust pipe. Um, for those of you who know what, about cars, the rubber seals had gone, so it was dragging on the floor at one end. So I had to, had to leave during my lunch break at work, take it to the garage and get it fixed and then get back to work for the afternoon so yeah it's no wonder my blood pressure blood pressure is up so nice relaxing friday reads um a nice relaxing weekend of just fiction where i don't have to to think too much about what's going on because you know obviously if it's a, a non-fiction book there's dates and names to take in but with this i can just you know just sit back and read and imagine and just oh heaven and I, I definitely need that this weekend so I'm really looking to my Friday reads I might do a bit more colouring I've done a bit of colouring this week if you follow me on Instagram you will have seen a picture of a rose that I coloured in so I do a bit more colouring it that depends on how I feel um yeah I'm really looking forward to this weekend so what are you planning on reading this weekend? I'm looking forward to watching all of your Friday reads, seeing what you're up to. Um, if you've read, um, I'm sure most of you have read this one, but if you have if you have read this one, obviously let me know. I'd love to know what you think about it. Obviously, if you want to talk about Harry Potter, that's great. Talk about Harry Potter, it's, it's fantastic. I haven't seen the new film yet, uh, Fantastic Beasts. I do want to see it. I might have to go on my own though. It's not good. Um, but yes. So that's my plan for the weekend. I'm curling up in bed and I'm just reading as much as I can because it's been stressful. There's been lots going on and I just need to read. So yes, if you want to um, comment on these books, please, please, please let me know what you think of them. And of course, um, share this video for your friends to see if they're into books. Who's not into books? Really, who's not into books? Yeah, okay. If you're not into books, go and stand in the naughty corner because I just do not want to talk to you because it's just wrong. Um, obviously, uh, give me the big thumbs up and if you're not already a subscriber, please subscribe. I will see you soon. I'll be back fairly shortly with some uh, other, other video things, including a uh, uh, mid-month wrap-up. That's going to be coming up fairly shortly. So I'll see you soon. Bye.